let's test the Nuka Cola from Fallout. Hey, bottle! How's about a nice cold Nuka Cola? It'll perk you right up. To start with the flavoring of a Nuka Cola, you've probably guessed it orange, lemon, and lime peel. Next, then we'll put a cinnamon stick. Just crack that in two. A whole nutmeg, but we'll crush it before we put it in. Some fresh coriander. We'll just put a few leaves in, should be fine. Followed in with some coriander seeds. Pour those in. Next thing goes half a vanilla pod. Need just a touch of licorice root to add a little bit more flavor. We'll cover this with some high strength alcohol to help extract the flavors. And finally, to help extract as much flavor as we possibly can, grab the vacuum chamber you keep lying around. We can see it's now bubbling away, which means all the flavor in the oils is coming out of our ingredients and infusing into our liquid, which is perfect. And finally, at this stage, we're gonna put in a few drops of amaretto, which is an almond flavor liqueur. So let's get those in. And as we mentioned before, this should work in a similar way to vanilla essence. The heat later on will cook off the alcohol, leaving us just the flavor. So now that we're done with our flavor infusion, we need to start our syrup. So we'll pour our sugar into a pan. And on top of that, we'll just add a few tablespoons of water. And finally, to add a little bit of our passion fruit flavor, we'll get that into a sieve over the top of our sugar. And we'll just press that to get the juice in there. So while our syrup's getting up to temperature, obviously I've not been able to find an exact list of ingredients for this, but I've tried my best to recreate it as close as I can. Obviously using some creativity where we needed to fill in some blanks. So I don't think this is going to be exactly the same, but it should be similar. And one thing we do have is 17 distinct ingredients to make what we're trying today instead of the 17 fruit flavors. So... So while our syrup is still very hot, let's add our flavoring so that it cooks off just like we mentioned before. We should be able to hear it cook. So you, oh, <coughs> and we'll just pour our syrup into a bottle here for later on. Of course, now we need to make our soda water. So let's place that into here and turn this on. So starting our assembly, in goes our soda water. To this goes our citric acid. A combination of three sweeteners to make it super sweet. Next in goes our syrup flavoring, as much as we can. And lastly, some food coloring, since we didn't get color from our syrup. Let's pour our cola into our bottle here. Just like so. Right, so there is our Nuka Cola from Fallout. I can't wait to try this. It's got such an interesting smell to it. Very sweet, sour, with a little hint of that passion fruit that comes through. So finally, let's test our Nuka Cola. Cheers. It's very sweet with that undercurrent of sour flavor that comes through and then just a hint of passion fruit and the vanilla is actually quite strong in there as well. If I was to change anything, I'd make it slightly more sparkling. The way we did it, we lost a bit of the uh, carbonation there. As far as to how close I think this is from the game, honestly, I don't know. It's really hard to tell because there isn't any official recipe or drink that we can try this against. But this does actually taste quite good. I would actually drink this. So that's a win for me at least. Comment what we should test next. Very cool.